nostalgic, though. I, I, I tend to go back to actually TV shows from my youth. And uh, actually, one show that I watched all the time when I came home from camp, Welcome to Pooh Corner. It was an oldie but a goodie, guys, but I loved it, okay? And so I'm sitting there, and I'm like reeling in the years like I'm Steely Dan. And then I look, and what, what strikes me is that Welcome to Pooh Corner is a veiled allegory for a drug emporium. No, no, I know, I know you're shocked as I was. No, but go with me on this for a second. Think about it, okay? If we're going to talk about the Don of the Pooh Bear Mafia, well, that's Winnie the Pooh. Winnie the Pooh is obviously a pothead. Think about it. He carries around a vat of honey everywhere he goes. He doesn't leave home without it like it's his MasterCard. Guys, I don't even have honey in my house, all right? And then Pooh Bear's carrying around baseline materials just in case he needs to get a quick fix. And think about it, right? Okay? Now, every conversation that Pooh Bear has relates back to food. Piglet says one of the nicest things I've ever heard anyone say to anyone, pretty much. He goes, Pooh Bear, if you live to be 100 years old, I hope to be 100 years old minus a day because I don't want to live a day of my life without you. Right? Which actually sounds suspiciously like marriage vows, if you think about it, which actually makes me wonder what else was going on in the 100 Acre Woods between Pooh and Piglet they weren't telling us about, right? But, but yeah, damn straight, mister. And you know what? And then his response, that's nice. I wonder what we're going to have for lunch. <laughs> Pooh Bear, that sentiment was so nice. And then Tigger's obviously a fucking cocaine addict. Okay? Do not tell me that the 100 Acre Woods coffee is that good in the cafeteria, okay? I ain't never seen a tiger do that shit, okay? At this point in time, it's like, okay, Tigger, easy or we're sending you to rehab. You're like one step away from dating Lindsay Lohan. All right? Eeyore is like the Sean Penn of the 100 Acre Woods. He's one of the most beloved characters of a generation. Everyone loves him, yet... Why are you so upset all the time? He's not. He's smoking some of Pooh's sweet weed. Think about it, okay? If I told you that you could hang in a beautiful meadow with all your best friends eating your favorite food, oats, what the fuck would you have to be upset about? That sounds like a fucking Beatles song to me. Are you kidding me? Sign me up for that shit. And then... Kanga and Rue, I mean, another single mother in a slum den. Guys, will the cliches never end? Unfortunately, the cliches will, as will this. Guys, I'm Jared Wilder. Thank you so very much. Have a good night, all right? Jared Wilder, keep it going for him. Very funny guy.